Alright guys, I just got done watching 21 Jump Street, and I thought this was a very good movie. Um, I can't remember how to say this guy's name. Channing Tatum and Jonah Hill. I thought they both did a great job in this movie. Um, it was very funny. I put off watching it until it was out on DVD, but I really enjoyed it. If you haven't seen it, you should definitely check this one out. Uh, there was something in this movie, and I don't want to give it away because I have no idea how this wasn't spoiled for me, so I'm not going to spoil it for anyone else, but there is a surprise at the end, um, towards the end, with a big mega Hollywood star making an appearance in the movie, and I thought it was great. And when I saw that, I was surprised as hell, and I had no idea. I was like, how was this not spoiled for me? So I'm not going to give that away, but... I thought it was really good, and I actually have uh, these <laughs> these DVDs of 21 Jump Street, um, the first season and the second season. I haven't actually watched them. They're not open or anything, but I do have the first two seasons, but I haven't watched it. I don't really know much about the original show at all. Uh, I know nothing about it, actually, and I just watched the movie, and it was really good. Um, it's about these two guys uh, who were kind of like rivals in high school, not really rivals, but Jonah Hill was a nerd and Channing Tatum was a jock and he would always pick on Jonah Hill. Jonah Hill goes to school like uh, dressed like Eminem and stuff like that and of course uh, Channing Tatum is like the big popular guy, everybody loves him. So we cut to eight years later, I believe, and they're both in the police academy to be police officers together. So Jonah Hill is really smart at the uh, book stuff, and Channing Tatum's really good at the physical stuff. So together, they make like one good cop. Um, and they get on this case to go do some type of undercover mission at a high school where these kids are taking some type of drug that makes them, uh, it makes them like see things and freak out and get like false confidence. There's stages of it. It goes through these stages of the drug and it happens repeatedly in the movie. But the best thing about this movie that was really funny was when they go back to high school eight years later, Jonah Hill is the cool kid and Channing Tatum is like hanging out with the nerdy kids. <laughs> it was just very funny like he pulls up in this cool car he got and like the cool kid in the high school I think his name was Eric who I would be surprised as hell if this kid was not related to James Franco I mean they look the same and they act the same I he's gotta be related to him but I haven't looked it up so I have no idea but the cool kid says uh, nice car what do you get like 10 miles to the gallon <laughs> Channing Tatum's like more like 7 <laughs> thinking that he's like being cool and stuff and it was just a ton of funny scenes like that throughout the entire movie uh, but what happens is Jonah Hill is finally living the high school life he's always wanted he's finally popular he's in with the cool kids this girl likes him this girl wants him to take her to prom uh, and Channing Tatum's telling him you know you're starting to forget about the case uh, this isn't your life and the other day I saw a college application on your desk and Jonah Hill's like, so what? I could go to college. I can be friends with Eric. Still, after all of this, I can keep going. And You know, I can go to college and maybe become a doctor or something. And he's like, are you listening to yourself? So it was really funny. And they're trying to find who the dealer and the suppliers are for this drug um, while all of this is occurring. And there's some shootouts and things like that. So it was a good mix of action and comedy. Just a very funny movie. Um, so I can't really recommend it enough. I think uh, everybody should watch this. It's very good. And that's it, really. Oh, and they kind of left it open at the end for a sequel, which I really hope they do, because I would love to see a sequel to this movie. And I actually, I believe it said that um, the script was written by Jonah Hill, or at least he co-wrote the script, something like that. Uh, but yeah, hopefully they do make a sequel, and... That's it, really. That's my review of 21 Jump Street. I hope you guys liked the video. Leave your thoughts on it in the comments below, and thanks for watching.